All right, my people, welcome to another edition of Just Reasoning, um, the show where we discuss issues of relevance to our community. Um, I'm one of your hosts, I'm C-Dub, Chris, um, my other regular host, Tex, and then we have a couple other special guests um, with us this evening. Um, our returning champion, um, the one and only <laughs> Police, also known as Lioness, also known as Officer Desiree. I won't say her whole name, but um, <laughs> and we have a really special guest. We will get into her uh, background when we get to the first interview segment. Um, her name is Dr. Nicole Walters. Um, Walters. She also Walters. goes by <laughs> Roommates. Is that another name we call her? And also, uh, my wife of umpteen years. Anyway, so, so she is an education professor, and we'll, that's why she's on the um, show today to, to discuss that. So before we get into discussing um, the issue, um, primary issue there being education in the age of COVID, um, and that's what that's what we're going to be discussing with the good Dr. Reverend. Um, Nicole Walters. <laughs> just talk about some issues, um, current issues that are going on. Um, there's some casual banter um, to begin with. Um, I'm going to share something on my screen. And I'm going to ask you guys if you know who this is. Um, you gone high tech in? Yeah, man. All right. So, <laughs> high tech. Can you see my screen? Yes, look at this beautiful baby. Do you know who that baby is? I know who it is. You know who it is? No. Police, you know who that is? Cindy Rose. It is not Cindy. You, you always no. get these questions wrong. It's not Cindy uh, Rose. It is not Cindy <laughs> Rose. She um, looks like you, Chris. She does. Hey, hey, watch your mouth now. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> no, she does not. Don't start now. Won't be nothing now. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> no, that is Usain Bolt and Cassie Bennett's new baby girl. Uh, awesome. Oh my gosh, she's beautiful. So they, they just released their picture. She was born like two months ago, but they just released their pictures for the first time today. And um, what do you think would be a fitting name for such a beautiful baby girl? Daughter of a an, uh, hmm. Olympic champion. Text you know, so tap your eyes. Yeah, I know, but I'm you thinking know, right? of another name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, thinking of something else. All right. So her name is Olympia Lightning Bolt. No. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Olympia Lightning Bolt. Are you so, serious? Like, hey, that is that, that is awesome. Awesome. What with a the, name. Hey, with a name like that. At, at least yeah. 10 gold medals, at least. Yeah. Yes. Olympia? Yes, wow. Olympia, Lightning. Yeah, so she and Sydney Rose left to be running on the Jamaica track team in a <laughs> few years. Yeah, man. So Olympia, Lightning, uh, welcome to the world. You have big shoes to fill, but hey. No kidding. Yeah, man. So wow. just wanted to start off with something like um, long-time girlfriend, like, like, like I said, um, you know, I don't know how long they've been together, but you know, I assume that will be wife someday. Um, and you know, I guess I don't. They have prenups in Jamaica. How that go? It's I cheaper have... to keep. Her. <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't. I really don't love their prenups in Jamaica. I've never heard of one. But they I do. Mean, what, they do. What, they do? Yeah. Okay. Ah. Uh, like, look, I have to research that. Um, no, no, no. <laughs> they do. They do. <laughs> So, where they also have prenups is in California, but that is also where Dr. Dre oh, um, yeah. did not get one. Right. Mm -hmm. um, 800 million dollars. 800, 900 million dollars. I was going to get his wife filed for divorce. But hey, I mean, this, this, they've been together for 24 years, married 24 years, so probably together longer than that. So it's not like she just come along for, you know, so she, she was, as they say, shooting in the gym. So, mm -hmm. you know, hey, mm -hmm. if you know, tell me that I'm broke when I have four hundred million dollars. So, it'll right. be all right. So, anyway, that's how it go. Um, yeah. Yep. 
Anyway, uh, one last thing before we kind of transition into the main topic at hand here is um, Prince Harry and uh, Meghan, what's your name, Meghan Markle? Markle. Markle, mm -hmm. Markle yeah. Mm -hmm. So they had a, a, a chat with a group of um, young leaders, I thought it's called the Queen's Commonwealth Trust, something like that, basically representatives, young representatives from former British colonies. And you know, they just discussing real issues like Black Lives Matter and, and what have you. And so, you know, he made a statement um, so that there's no way that we can move forward unless we acknowledge the sins of our past, right? So coming from somebody in the monarchy to say that, wow. you know, that's kind of a, a big deal, right? And, you know, and, and they said a whole lot more. It was a, it was a long discussion, but, you know, as we hear in the U.S., you know, talk about the issues around Black Lives Matter and what have you, we just have to realize that this is a universal struggle. I mean, Black it really is catching hell all about. And the British are the original colonizers, right? They, <laughs> they were colonizing yeah. before it was cool. Right, right. right. So, you know what right. I mean? So, so when we talk about things like reparations and what have you, hey, you know, um, the British have to answer for the damage that they've done around the world as well. So that's... Uh, True. That's going to be a longer discussion. Um, and re real into that discussion, you know, there's a, a conversation, really argument, <laughs> I've been online the past few days um, about basically who gets reparation here in the US. I mean, how do you define that? Uh, and, you know, the, many people have the belief that it, you, it's not just because you're black. You know, you have to be an American, a descendant of American slaves. And that turned into some long discussion about Caribbean or African and anyway that's a that's a a longer discussion that I wanted to get into at some point but uh, just a few introductory topics um, before we get to the main topic at hand 